What's up, Thrive Tribe? I hope y'all been well. Happy almost Friday. I know y'all having a fantastic day. So here it is. I'm making all these posts, and it literally hit me like, did I set the expectations with the community or future subscribers and subscribers of what to expect from the channel? And of course, I got lost in the YouTube. I don't know. I, I don't even know what to call it. In the making a YouTube channel great madness by watching a ton of videos, everyone, you know, having different takes on what makes a good channel, what's going to make you get monetized, pick a niche, pick a structure, make sure they know what they're going to get when they come to your page. Like, I've just, yeah, how? So, um, with that being s said, literally, this is going to be the Walmart Sam's Club Nordstrom of YouTube, literally. I, as an individual, I'm into one too many things that I find interesting, that hopefully somebody else is going to find interesting or want to get m more information on. So that's what honestly made me come down to the, what is it? The understanding that it needed to be something that literally showcased me as a person when it comes to this YouTube channel. However, still gave value, literally give value. That us, that's, that's, that's my main thing for the channel, right? So either way i'm giving value on how to make money by f f flipping um products uh selling on amazon selling on walmart um doing doing your your, your credit repair cpns uh what else what else making a cleaning business like there's just so many th things that i've personally ventured into and I personally don't know about y'all, but if I'm taking advice from someone, I want it to be from someone that's been where I'm trying to go or been somewhere that I'm currently at so I could at least, you know, um, bounce ideas uh, off of uh, off of that person or find out, well, what do you think is good or what do you think is bad and just make, make it work, right? Feel me? So... That's pretty much where I'm like, I right, this channel is not just going to be about one, one, one thing. Um, I do want to post one to two videos um, a week. Every two weeks, I want to do an analytical breakdown of the ch channel in reference to, you know, the growth and everything else. I don't know much, much about analytics. I'm not even thinking I'm a venture into much of that. However, being that I am starting off this channel brand new and some pe some individuals might be into it, I'll find time to make that content. I do want to start going live. I know I'm probably going to be speaking to a blank wall, but hey, it is what it is. I have to start somewhere. Um, but yeah, man, it was just me going through the turmoil of, all right, so what I want to talk about, I want to talk about health more than I talk about how to make money. Who do I want to talk to? You know, people are like, oh, choose a single parent. And then, then I have my ho homeboys that are like, you know, when people say single parents, a majority of the time, they don't consider m men. It goes back to w women. And then I really had to sit here and look at it like, damn, most of my f friends, especially my most of my friends are in the digital marketing space, single parents and a single moms or mom with blah, blah, blah. So I did catch a little whiff of that when, you know, I'm speaking to them and I'm getting more background insights as so what does it feel like to be on the receiving end as a single parent in a male perspective compared to a female perspective? So, um, like I said, I just want on the channel to be a safe space, inclusive space, and it could be a single parent, non-single parent, a person that's like myself. Hey, we 36 out here struggling and we're just trying to make it like everybody else. You feel me? 
so there's just different ways how we, we could all look at different things that take place and hell try to make sense out of not on sense but essentially I wouldn't be able to give value to anyone that comes to the channel and when I say it's not gonna be a one size fit all um, before I got in, in before I got in, injured you know I've done uh, insurance adjusting I've done wholesaling um, I've done uh, Amazon FBA I've done just regular Amazon I've done flipping in the aspect of like buying pallets, reselling items, just so many different things that I like to touch on on the ch channel that's going to bring light to everything because honestly, not everybody might have the funds to venture into certain things. However, a lot of things are also uh, cost effective to where you can j jump in with three four hundred dollars and you can make it work also another th thing y'all y'all gonna spend m money to, to make m money if you're not going to put in the t t time you're gonna put in money if you're gonna put in money then you don't have to put in that m much t time but take it from someone like uh, myself before I wanted to learn how to do everything. That's another reason why I got involved into so many things because I'm like, all right, if I know how to do this, I'm gonna pay for it. I'm sick. Nah, bro, delegate, pass it on. I'm good. <laughs> you know, so now I'm learning, trust me, to just let go, let God, let it do it, do. Um, but overall, I'm like, there's just so many things that I'm in into to where it's just like, I can't sit here and only build a channel only talking about credit or talking about CPNs. Like, yeah, I love this stuff, but there's more to me than that. You feel me? Um, what else? What else? What else? Oh, I'll stay in some of my lives. I want to be able to build my Legos. Let me show y'all what my collection looks like. It's super small. Nothing major. All right. So this right here is my miniature Lego collection. This box right here. I'm out here breaking stuff, but yeah, that's basically filled with Legos. I'm working on this car right here now um, to build, build that out. So I might go ahead and just go live with that. So yeah, man, I just have a lot of different things that I'm planning on bringing to the table. If it sticks, it sticks. If it doesn't stick, it doesn't stick. However, uh, yeah, you could definitely ex expect to have different perspectives of different takes on so many different things, honestly. Um, you know, just, you know, come along for the journey, bro. Like I said, I just want this to be a safe space. Oh, let's not even talk about journaling. So I love journaling. However, I recently was going through my past two months of journaling and it's like, I'll go up, down, in between, why am I here? And then, you know, I'm negative for like days on end. And then next minute I'm happy as, whoa. I, I, I'm so, I'm, now I'm like, all right, you gotta cut that out. Um, I'm literally working on just always trying to have a positive mindset. And this is where I was like, all right, I'm going to still start including some of my um, journaling into, to, into these videos because it is so crazy that here it is, you know, in one day my whole life ch changed. And there's just a lot of things that you feel like was once important. Now is like, man, I could kill less type of situation. That's pretty much where I was at with, with that. So now I'm just trying to find different outlets and just meet new individuals along the way. Like I said, I'm probably not going to edit this video in any way, shape or form. Um, this is literally raw, uncut, 
straight from a horse's mouth and honestly if you subscribe you're gonna be in good hands if you don't subscribe you're still in good hands make sure when you see the video you share it with somebody that might need it and i get it my thumbnails and my and my uh what is it and my um my tag not tag my titles might not be up to par bro it's it's coming all right Having a traumatic brain injury has literally taught me, like, patience in slowing down, unbeatable. Literally un unbeatable. Not to mention, it has humbled the F out, out, out of me. So, yeah, this, this is all something new, and I'm really ha happy that I'm able to have different individuals venture into it with, with me. Um, Y'all ain't got to worry about the videos being long. My ADHD does not permit me to do things su super long. Um, if I have a brain fart, you're going to hear me say squirrel. I don't know where the hell that came from, but I've been using that for years. Um, if something really do stand out, I'd be like, on God and Mary ha had a little lamb. I don't know where that came from either. There's just certain things that I s say that just... You know it's it's a bit, it's been here so if i use these terminologies y'all already know what 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 time it is um what else what else what else i'm trying to think bro i'm trying to think i i can't think if i come up with anything else i'll definitely be making another video but i love y'all hope y'all have a fantastic rest of your day and again whatever y'all want to see drop it um yeah hopefully we could all just go and learn from each other and yeah if y'all got any good stories like i said hit me up because i want to hear i'm just looking to get to know people that want to know me and that's how we go rock it right so i love y'all i hope y'all are having a great day stay safe and uh again whatever you're going through just know you're not alone and you got somebody that's right here with you in spirit in a video whatever it is air hugs but I lo love y'all. See y'all later.